until I have none left. Welcome to Cinemuts. Oh, no. I'm Matt. I'm not. This is part two. Dose oh, of, oh, <laughs> of Depo Society. There's sadness at the end of this video. Momucho sadness. We're going to jump right back in here with the rest of my notes from Dead Poet Society. This is totally on the same day. We just wanted to change clothes. And Keating has them all on the line lined up to kick um, a uh, soccer ball, right? Okay. And before they kick the ball, they have to re recite a line of poetry from the like, right Before they kick the ball, they're like, ooh, to live is to die and to die is to live. <laughs> good, good, mister. I'm so alone, please help. Ooh. <laughs> Sad. Ooh. Kick the ball, please. Just kick it and go go to the back of the line. I get that a lone bagpipe player at dawn on a misty lake is a cool image, but what? This fucker's playing the saxophone in a barrette, basically doing slam poetry. I'm not a fan of this. Robert Frost once said, there's a fork in the road, and I buried a body on the one path, but I'll never tell you which one. Never. <laughs> I don't think that's the rest of the poem. If it oh. is, I... It's great. Finally, some fucking girls in the cave. Oh. From now on, call me Nuwanda. The fuck is wrong with these kids? Call me Nuwanda. Why? It was on Tumblr. Too mutt. They clink glasses. What's mutt up to these days? Oh, mutt. Actually died a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> I just dropped his name to get free shot. <laughs> Well, this kid's about to sleep creep Chris, and he's just justifying it with carpe diem. What's going on? Carpe diem. Girl in cave. Don't you guys miss having girls around here? Doesn't really seem like it. Does not. This teenage boy is getting paddled on the ass by this old man. This is another really strange choice for the cinemuts. <laughs> yeah. Boys are literally sitting at the kid who got paddled's feet listening to him retell the story while he strokes a set of Congos and wears sunglasses indoors. We had a very different definition of cool where I grew up. Tell us about how you hit your ass, Jimmy. Well, you see. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> He's, He's so, so cool. <laughs> I don't care if the world comes to an end tomorrow night. You are through with that play. Am I clear? And this guy hates plays. <laughs> Ooh. Seems unethical to allow students to visit one-on-one -on -one with the teacher in their bedroom at night. Why is that okay? The sleep creeper is going back to see Chris. He's bringing her flowers. I guess that's proper sleep creep etiquette. Hey, so I really enjoyed watching you the other night while you slept. I'm sorry, you, you did what? Here so it. I got you these flowers. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm learning... Okay. New Wanda has now painted a red lightning bolt on his chest for virility. Bro, leave some pussy for the rest of us. <laughs> Chris has now agreed to go on a date with the sleep creep. Either the writer or I really don't understand women. The writer loosely based the Dead, Dead Poet Society off of himself growing up. Oh, this is really fucked up. This got real... The kid who's been sneaking off to be in a play is the one who gets to hang out with girls. Nice. Aw. His father who hates plays showed up. My poor father had to sit through the elephant man my junior year. Definitely not his cup of tea. Definitely not. That's what fathers do. Oh. The dad was not happy about him being a fairy. Whoa. So much so that he's sending him to military academy and then Harvard. I don't think he'll get to be a fairy for a while. He's shirtless with his fairy crown back on. Yeah, that's not a metaphor. He's got his fairy crown back on from the play. And it's yeah, not... Has. I was like, this is getting ominous. What's going on? Holy fuck. This kid's about to shoot himself. Ooh, cinemats, I guess. Why did we choose this movie? So the final 20 minutes becomes the deterioration of the dead poet society and people passing the blame for the kid's death until Robin Williams is fired. Ooh. Well, hold on, we reached the end of Dead Poets Society. How you feel about it? I like that movie a lot. It's one of those movies where you can't see, like, repeatedly. I gave it a thumbs down. Yeah. yeah. Why? I did not like it. It could have been executed better. Overall, I bet you it's a good script. It's a really weird movie, man. I wouldn't recommend this to anybody, unless you're a teacher. 
Um, no. I definitely go would rec- see Dead Poets Society. I, never mind then. All right, here we go. Holden's notes. Holden's notes. <laughs> Holden's notes.